As tensions rose during a heated exchange, one man made the ill-fated choice to spit in the face of a fellow subway passenger. Little did he know, he'd chosen the wrong person to target, and the entire incident was captured on video. Although details are few, a video of the subway incident has circulated widely online, garnering attention each time it reappears. It shows a man spitting on another rider, not once, but twice. The footage captures the exact moment the subway spitter receives his comeuppance, and it's safe to say he'll think twice before attempting this again. According to the New York Post, the incident occurred at the 34th Street Station in Manhattan, where a man spat in the face of another passenger twice as the subway doors were closing, believing himself to be safe. Since his target was now trapped behind closed doors, the subway spitter casually remained on the platform, making no attempt to flee. He would quickly realize this was a mistake. To the spitter's surprise, his victim managed to pry the subway doors open, and once he did, it was game on and game over. For the offender, in a matter of seconds, chaos erupted as the man who had been spat on burst onto the platform, launching into a series of blows directed at his attacker's head. Fists flew in a flurry, leaving the subway spitter unconscious. According to the footage, which was posted across social media platforms, including Reddit and YouTube, he's livid. It's over. The person filming the encounter can be heard saying, referring to the man who'd been spat on. As other riders attempted to intervene, the camera operator advised them to step back and let the incident unfold. Nah, nah, he spat in his face. He tells the onlookers, allowed to continue his beatdown. The victim quickly turned the tables, rendering the spitter unconscious. With his target incapacitated, the victim retrieved his phone from the ground and walked away, not without shouting a few choice words at his foe, who lay crumpled on the platform motionless. The exact date of the incident and the platform where it took place remain unclear. Neither the MTA nor the NOIPD responded to New York Post's request for comment. Nevertheless, there's an important lesson to be learned here. Spitting on someone constitutes assault, and many will react to being spat on with the same anger as if they had been struck. It's also unwise to underestimate your intended victim or to assume a pair of subway doors will protect you. This isn't to suggest that rendering someone unconscious is a proportionate response. The victim in this case seemed to act on pure rage, but spitting is undeniably one of the most cowardly and disgusting things one can do, especially when done in a way that leaves the victim feeling helpless as the subway doors close. Make no mistake, spitting is an aggressive act that often invites an equally intense response. Before deciding to spit at someone, be prepared to face the consequences. It's almost always wiser to simply walk away. The man left on the ground likely wishes he had, while spitting might not justify a brutal response. It's hard to feel sympathy for someone who instigates such a reaction. This incident will likely serve as a lasting reminder for the subway spitter to think twice before choosing his next target.